Now guys, in this video, we'll be looking at the quickest way to insert running totals or cumulative sum. The running totals are important in data analysis as they show the overall progress. On my screen here is a table and it has actually been pre-formatted into a table before now. So before you can actually achieve this, make sure that you formatted your set of data into a table. So at the end of where you want to insert the running total, what you just need to do is to hit what? Equal to take note of the cell that I'm actually working on, cell E2. So equal to, so use the sum function and open brackets. So when, Excel asks you number one, you should select the very first guy at the top, then comma, the number two should be this, then you now close it up. Now notice the magic that happens once you hit enter. Because your table has been preformatted, Excel will quickly calculate the cumulative sum of that whole column for you and automatically. And that is how to actually find running totals so if you notice the first cell says what 16.448 is all right then the second one says what 28.232 actually what the cumulative sum does or the running total does is to add up this particular cell with this to give you this okay this particular cell with this to give you this it's very very simple so by so doing you save a whole lot of man hour trying to do it manually one at a time now we are going to resize this particular column and name it what running totals is that okay so running running totals so hit enter so i'm going to expand it more so i'm going to format this accordingly let me just copy painter then format it as the case may be Hope you got value in this video if you have any question drop it in the comment section below also like and share this video on your screen is a video on microsoft excel data summary go ahead to watch it right away excel made easy